Oh, I love Melissa. I love her. <laughs> and I watch her show. Yeah. Hi, everyone. I'm Melissa. Welcome back to Out There. Well, it's been over 40 years of slaps, scandals, and secret revelations on the iconic soap opera, Young and the Restless. So as we decide to celebrate 40 years, we sat down with friend of the show and also reoccurring character on YNR, Tanya Lee Williams, or as we also like to call her, Dr. Olivia Barber Winters, to get all the dish on the drama. Check it out. Oh, I'm so glad you can be on the show finally after, how many years have I known you? You're just so busy doing Young and the Restless no and movies way. and things. I love that I'm here. I'm, I love that I'm in town for it. Yes, which is good. So thank you so much. I have to talk about Young and the Restless because it, it's such a staple in people's homes. People grew up with it. In fact, I'm not gonna lie, our cameraman Kevin uh, <laughs> is trying to hold his breath. He's a huge fan. Kevin knows all the storylines. You know what, I never noticed at all when he came over and asked me like a million things that I don't even know anything about. Any other uh, plot questions there, Kevin? <laughs> yeah, get it out of your system, Kevin. <laughs> What's gonna happen with Devon and the music business? Devon. <laughs> oh, yes! You know, cousin Devon? Devon, the deaf guy, yeah. has a music business? <laughs> so you know the thing here is... Isn't that weird, don't do you, you think? Do you know, a little unusual? Do you know what's a little unusual here is? The time that your show airs right. in the city... He's supposed to be working. He's supposed to be working. Yeah. <laughs> and so this is what's not good. When this goes back to the network boss, gonna be a problem. No, or even stranger, he's TiVoing it and catching up on the weekend. Yeah. Honey. Here. Hi. <laughs> it was Drew's. Oh. Yeah, I, I wore this the first time I married Kane. Man, it's so crazy. It's like, like they were meant to be together, oh. right? <laughs> <laughs> You know, I just know that Drew is up there just losing her mind over the fact that you're getting married here in France. I don't think people really understand or appreciate the amount of work yes. that soap actors do, the amount of dialogue that you yes. have to pull off with very little time and storylines that you yes. know last minute. So tell me about sort of well, I handling feel, all that. I feel now that we're getting the last laugh because um, because productions are really changing and budgets are shrinking, I'm finding that nighttime and movies are moving as fast as daytime now. Um, because my friends used to laugh, you know, 15 years ago, like, oh my God, you got all this dialogue you're gonna do, and now they're like, we're trying to shoot half the movie in four days. So this has become the norm. People have to move quickly, you have to know a lot of dialogue, and you just have your little tricks. 